Hello guys, so I'm off the Crane Valley Golf Club, which is in Burwood. Um, the weather outside is pretty dull. We've got a lot of rain, we've got some high winds. I'm going to try and get round and do the whole 18 if I can, just to show you. If I can't, I'll do the 9 and I'll do the next 9 another day and I'll uh, post it on here. Um, hope you enjoy the video. So for anyone who's never played here, just across here on my right hand side, that's the nine hole golf course. They also do foot golf there too. That's a nice little one to practice on. So that's the first tee off, straight down and it's just to the right. Uh, we're looking at three, two, five off the yellows. So yeah, at the moment I'm just under the umbrella because it's um, coming down pretty heavy now. But like I said, it's a straight shot and then the green is just behind the trees right in front of you. Over there. I think I've just landed mine into the trees. So we're just going to have a look. Hopefully I've got a shot into the green. As you can probably see, there's the green just behind the trees. So that's the place where I didn't want it, right behind the tree. So what I'm gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to play out there and then come back in because the green is just over there. So we're on hole number two now, it's the first of the par five. Uh, we're looking at 507 yards. You've got to go through that gap. Um, it's quite tight actually. It does open up on the other side. Um, and then you've got a shot into the green if you're a big hitter. You've got a few bunkers up there. So you just got to watch out for them for your second shot. That's how we get on. So unfortunately I didn't make it past the tree, so I'm hindered now by the tree. So I'm gonna have to come out a little bit to then give me a shot straight up because the green is up there. So this is a par four, a hole number three. Um, it is quite a long way for a par four. To be honest, I think it should be a par five. Um, you've got a lake to the right and you've got to watch out, it, especially if you're a left-hander, not to go into the tree uh, there on the left. So I'm looking at 228 yards to the green, so I'm gonna get my hybrid out, um, hopefully just short of the green, and then pitch on.
perfect. So you can see that's just where I wanted it. It's a nice little chip up under the green, hopefully to putt it. As you can see, all the green is all elevated. So we've got a small par four here. Um, it's just beyond those in the bunker now. So that's the green over there, just behind the workers. Nice to see them working in the rain. So hole number five then, uh, we're looking at 396 to the flag. Um, you might be able to see the white flag just beyond the uh, telegraph pole up there. So it's a nice straight shot. Great drive, so hopefully I should either be on the green in two or just short of it. You've got to be careful because behind the flag there is a little lake or river behind. So for that I'm looking at 165 to the middle of the green. So it was a great second shot, I'm just off the green. Um, hopefully I'll just chip it on. If I can one putt it'd be great. If not, we two putt it for five. So there I am for two, so just short of the green. So hopefully I can get somewhere near to give me a chance for the par. Okay, so I did say it was less than 100 yards. It's actually 108 yards by the watch. Um, as I said, it is quite tricky. You've got some water directly in front of you. Um, you don't want to be going to the left because it does slope down. You'll go into the trees. If you can, just stay more right because it does open out.
So you've got to be careful approach it from this side because if you hit it too hard, there is a slope down and then you'll end up in the water. So we go. So again, this is a straight one again. Um, you've got to go beyond that bunker. Uh, when you do do that, there is a bunker um, ahead of that as well. And then you've got the green. So I'm on the green for two. Um, I went just to right of the bunker with my drive. And I chipped over the trees. And now I'm on air playing three. So it's another little par three. We're looking at 170 straight down. Quite an easy one this one. So there I am to my drive, chip on, hopefully one putt it. So we're looking at 516 yards. Um, you've got to be careful with your drive here because there is a bunker in the middle of the fairway. Um, you can hit it, depends if it's wind against or not. We'll give it a go so we can get past. So unfortunately with my drive I landed straight into the bunker. That's one place where I didn't want to be. So I used my pitching wedge to get out. And then I used my hybrid. I did hit it about 200 yards and I'm somewhere just off the fairway. So I'm on my full shot now. So hopefully I'll be on the green on this shot. Doing that. So guys, that's the first nine at Crane Valley. Unfortunately, I'm just about to run out of battery. So what I'll do in the next couple of weeks, I'll um, put the back nine on here so you can all see it. If you like the video, please like and subscribe it and I will do more in the future.